you can improve the composition of your photos and highlight your main subject by cropping out unwanted areas. Select the photo and click the Edit button. Next, click the Crop button. To indicate which portion of the photo you want to keep, change the size and position of the crop area. To resize the crop area, drag one of its corners or its edges. To move the crop area, drag inside it. When you move or resize the crop area, a grid divides the area into thirds. You can often improve the composition of a photo by placing its main subject along one of the inner lines of this grid. This composition technique is often called the rule of thirds. When you're happy with the crop, click Apply or press the Return key. The portion of the photo outside the crop area is removed. Oftentimes you may want to control the proportions of the crop area so that your photo fits a certain print size or display dimensions. To do that, click the Constrain box, then choose an option. For example, if you plan to order an 8x10 inch print of a photo, choose the 8x10 option. When the Constrain box is checked, the proportions of the crop area will always fit the proportions you choose. To switch between a horizontal and vertical crop area, hold down the Option key while dragging one of the corners. Here are a couple of tips. When you crop a photo, it automatically changes everywhere, for example, in slideshows, books, and calendars. To crop a photo without changing it everywhere, make a duplicate of the photo by selecting it and choose Duplicate from the Photos menu. Then crop the duplicate.